You think we're the only ones with strange mating habits. Think again. From exploding testicles, to shooting love darts, to drinking pee. Here are five animals from around the world, with the weirdest mating habits. First on our mating list. The flat worm. Because flatworms are capable of being the male or female during sexual reproduction, the first rule in mating for any pair of these lovers is to decide who plays what role. To settle it, they engage in an activity that is called penis fencing, which is pretty much what it sounds like. Using their penises as swords, the two flatworms battle it out to see who can inseminate the other first, which is accomplished by stabbing the other in the underside. The loser ends up being responsible for the laying and carrying of the eggs, which is a considerable burden on the flatworm. Next on our list. Garden snails. When garden snails meet, they first get to know each other by crawling all over one another. Then, one of the snails will stab the other with a love dart, and no, that isn't a euphemism, it's actually called a love dart. It's essentially a sharp dart that stabs into the other snail's body, injecting hormones to help that snail become more successful in the ensuing attempt to mate. After the love dart has been administered, the male-oriented snail will then insert his two penises into the two vaginal tracts that the receiving snail has. The female-oriented snail then takes the now-fertilized eggs and digs a hole in the dirt. Laying the eggs, the snail will go on its way, ready to mate again. If conditions are right, a snail can mate once a month and lay eggs equally as often. Next up. Hyenas. Within hyena societies, female hyenas hold a dominant position, with the highest ranking females exhibiting dominance over males. As part of their mating behaviors, female hyenas engage in a phenomenon called pseudopenis, where their enlarged clitoral organ closely resembles the male genitalia. Unlike many other animals, hyenas don't have a specific mating season. Instead, they are known for their frequent and prolific mating habits. Researchers have observed that hyenas mate multiple times throughout the day, with an average of six copulations occurring in a 24-hour period. These intense mating rituals provide an explanation for their laughter-like vocalizations. For our fourth entry. The giraffe. This sexual hunt involves the male prodding the rear ends of different females with his head. Some females will respond by spreading their legs and urinating, sparking a so-called flame in response from the male, he will lift his upper lip, flare his nostrils and inhale. In addition to sniffing the urine, he may even taste it, taking in additional chemical cues to see if the female is ready to mate. Once a male finds a fertile female, he will mount her from behind. The female has to cooperate for mating to occur as she has to delicately balance a mate that could weigh as much as 50% more than her. After successfully mounting a female, the male ejaculates almost immediately, typically in less than 2 seconds. For our final entry. The anglerfish. When scientists first started capturing anglerfish to study, they were baffled at why all the specimens were female. Though the males were nowhere to be found, female anglerfish were rarely discovered alone. Many came with tiny parasites attached to them. After more examination, scientists learned that those parasites are male anglerfish. In some species, the males are not even capable of feeding themselves. Instead, they must find a female to attach themselves to, or die. After attaching, their circulatory systems merge, and she provides him with sustenance via her blood, while he provides her with sperm. The female is the only one with the lighted lure, capable of ambushing predators and the male measures a mere inch and is parasitic, rather than predatory. So, what did you think of the mating habits of these animals? 
Which one shocked you the most? Drop a comment and let me know. Thank you for watching.